Libras, you need to move in silence and capitalize on this opportunity that's getting ready to present itself to you. You have the six of coins and the three of coins here as the overall energy. The six of coins is your energy, Libra, as well as Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is taking some type of gamble, some type of risk, and it working out in your favor either way that it goes. This three of coins is things perfectly aligning themselves so that you can take this opportunity. Libras, tap in. Libra family, welcome back to my channel. This is Down to Earth Tarot. Be sure to hit that like button. Rep your city, your state, your country down below. Special shout out to all the Libra family in the great state of Michigan, capital city of Lansing and Detroit. I upload almost daily, so you're going to want to hit the notification bell. Reach out to me for personal readings. All that information is down below in the description box. You can email me, find me on Instagram. Again, all my information is down below in the description box. Be sure, Libras and or cross watchers, to check out your sun, moon, rising, and Venus placement videos for a deeper look at your situation or theirs because this, this reading is general. So take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Libra family, opportunity is about to be placed in front of you. We see this father of knives and the mother of knives or queen and king of swords here, both in the reverse. We also see the daughter or the knight of swords as well. So we got the whole family. For some of you, this may be a family opportunity. For others of you, you this may be a marriage opportunity, somebody giving to two, or maybe some of y'all been thinking about leaving a relationship right? You've been stacking your coins or waiting for the right opportunity, the right moment. For others of you, it may be a job that you need to let go of, a business opportunity presenting itself. Because we see the 10 of coins here right in the middle, this five of coins, Taurus energy. This 10 of coins is closing out a cycle into abundance, generational wealth, good health, being in control of your time, family, this five of coins is an abandonment of a trail, a plot twist. You know, the rug being pulled out from underneath somebody and some things being illuminated here. Triumph, the grass being greener on the other side, Libra. With the sun card, for others, it may be fertility, rolling the dice, right? Things being upside down. But this is some things being illuminated, shown to you. See this Capricorn energy here with the devil, Miss Robinson. We see Aries energy here with the John Horse or the Emperor in the reverse. Leo Sagittarius with the Sun. Libra, your energy with the Justice card in the reverse. We see this Cardinal energy, Capricorn, Libra. Could be it. Could be another Libra Capricorn that you're dealing with. But this speaks to temptation and self-sabotage. Repeating the same cycles over and over and over again. This could be obsessions, um, addictions, behaviors that are no longer serving you. Toxic relationships. Again, some of y'all trying to get out of that, capitalizing on a right opportunity, making more money, signing a lease, getting a car, whatever the case may be. But this also speaks to to toxic relationships feeling stuck or bound to something, maybe feeling like you owe somebody. This mother of knives and this father of knives, both of these people, these energies being that of somebody who is highly intelligent. But we see somebody running out of time here with this father of knives. I see these broken clocks. Come on, camera, hold me down. These broken clocks here, we see this knife out, this knife down in the dirt, but it's up in the, with this being in the reverse, right? And somebody trying to protect themselves. Somebody may be coming towards you talking about an opportunity that they've been holding in their back pocket for you. For some of you, this may be coming in at the 11th hour, talking about getting back in this relationship. Maybe somebody that's that you've left behind or that has left you behind. We see this emperor here, which is a married man, a father figure, a you know a husband, leader. It could be, again, some of y'all, this is a workplace, a boss that's just terrible, doesn't know how to communicate, a piss poor thinker. Then we also have this cunning, manipulative, selfish energy here with this mother of knives. This is somebody who's bitter, angry. Again, this is a married couple at odds, but this could very well be uh, a boss that doesn't know how to do their job. And then their little crony over here causing a whole lot of drama. You getting that position that you want or a way out of this damn department. For others of you in a relationship, this is something toxic where somebody is refusing to commit, commitment being here at the forefront. And maybe this is where you exit stage left here with this mother and I is releasing yourself from this. Maybe it has to do with somebody having a lack of boundaries, 
again, a lack of communication. But we see proof here with this mother of knives. This sword down in this book, receipts, notes, screenshots, emails. There's proof of something that was going on behind your back. And for some of you Libras, it may have to do with the fact that you've made yourself less available here to somebody with this uh, daughter of knives, knight of swords energy. Because we see a lot of people reaching out, wanting to access you, but I, I don't get a lot of return phone calls or return messages here. For others of you, this may be... <laughs> The plot twist that now you've made yourself less available when somebody was being inconsistent with you in and out. Did, you didn't know what the hell was going on with them, with this daughter of sticks or the knight of wands, which is that inconsistent player energy. Some of you, this can be a fence straddler. And this nine of wands here, big Sagittarius energy, which speaks to protecting yourself, putting up a wall and getting ready to release some things and close out a cycle. You see the Bible in one hand and a pistol in the other. This is Somebody not playing games and protecting their energy. It's nice that this person wants to come and communicate now, make you some type of offer and trying to trying to fix it. Again, when you have a new offer coming in is when they're going to try and rush in and fix this. But it'll be too late. This ten of wands here, it'll be too late. Too much has happened. Now they want to talk about all these heavy burdens. Oh, you're hold, leaving them holding the bag here. They didn't give a damn about you holding the bag, Libra. They didn't give a damn when you were overwhelmed. They didn't give a damn when you were reaching out to them and they didn't have anything to say to you. Sending you right to voicemail. Oh, they'll get back to you at their uh, soonest convenience. Is that right? A lot of y'all are moving on from a situation. That's what this opportunity is and you capitalizing on it with the six of swords. Moving on to calmer water. Some of y'all are just cutting somebody off, leaving it right where it stands. This eight of pentacles here, because some of y'all were trying to make it work. Again, with this devil card here and somebody looking over their shoulder, for some of y'all you were stuck trying to make it work with this individual and it was holding you back. This justice card in the reverse speaks to a hypocrite, not making decisions here, indecision, lies. This is definitely a situation where whether this is work, family, or a lover, this person is not does not think you're serious until you're already gone. There are people that are not believing in your business idea until it's popular for people to support you, until somebody else wants to put you on. Virgo energy here, Libras with the Dr. Grant or the Hermit. Shout out to those of you on the Virgo uh, Libra cusp. And drop your birthday so I can tell you happy birthday, Libra. But this speaks to separating yourself, going through a period of deep introspection, doing your own thing, having some quiet time. And again, putting in the work so that things perfectly align for you. This is not luck. This is not things just happening. This is putting in the work. So those of you that have been being lazy, sitting around and just hoping for a miracle, this is not for you. This is not your reading. The father of six. This is for the people that put verbs in their sentences, right? The walkers, not just the talkers here with the king of wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, getting things done, making it happen. The seven of baskets here and the seven of knives. Listen. Some of y'all are dealing with people that you can't trust that again, that are smiling in your face. And stabbing you in the back as soon as you turn it here with the seven of baskets. Again, these people acting like they want to give you certain opportunities or acting like they're in your corner. But really, they, they're with you as long as you're not doing better than them or on the same level as them with the seven of knives. This is somebody who is sneaky and untrustworthy. We see the sun of baskets here. And the, right. It's fake love. It's this person playing games. And some of you, you already see this person, Libra. Drop this person sign. You see this individual and their little games that they're playing. We see this water and this air, heavy that over here in this corner with the clarifiers. What's this person's real intentions? They're jealous. This is jealousy. Somebody may have been trying to hold you back or take certain opportunities from you because they were lacking in opportunities or seeing their opportunities as small. Maybe trying to put down what you had going on, minimalizing it. They're about to see. And again, with the moving in silence, the fact that you didn't tell them what was going on, they just assumed you didn't have anything going on. Ace of coins here. 
Mm. This is money on the floor. This is a commitment coming in. This is contracts, money, pentacles, secure in the bag, Libras. Again, you don't have to talk about it. This is being about it. The five of sticks here, which is gossip, rumors, conflict, chaos, confusion. Right. People don't know what's going on with you. People shouldn't know what's going on with you. We got the five of wands here, the five of pentacles. Come on now. This ten of pentacles here. Everything's adding up. Again, this is for the people that are putting in the work. That earth and fire energy. The five of basket. Five, five, five. Changes. Major changes. Major opportunities coming. And you're taking advantage of these opportunities that are being placed in front of you. This John Horses Emperor being clarified by the ten of cups. Some of y'all, this person's going to want to come back even after you've achieved all this success or capitalize on these opportunities. Oh, now these people want to be your friends. Oh, now they want to support you. Now they want to be smiling in your face for real. Oh, now you invited to ravioli night. Oh, mm. more money, more problems. This son of coins, page of... Pentacles and this Nine of Swords, anxiety, stress. Some of y'all need to be very careful about the people that are going to be around you when you're on this next level, right? This Two of Coins, because you got people flip flopping back and forth that are only invested in what they can get from you in this new space. Let's get into this devil. What's this? We got this falling out. A liar. Somebody who is deceptive and manipulative, but that is the devil energy. But this is Gemini Aries here with this magician of earth. This is somebody who is deceptive, manipulative. Again, we see power on that wand there, clear as day. Can we see that? Yes, a little bit. Um, for some of this is about power and control. Again, with the person that's minimalizing what you got going on. The people that are gossiping. Oh, Libra ain't got nothing on. I don't see nothing. I don't see them doing anything on social media. Everybody's not trying to be fake on the, in, on the Instagram. The king of pentacles here. Taurus energy. This speaks to stability. Having a high moral compass. Being grounded. We see this genie lamp here. making, Putting in the work and making your own dreams and wishes come true. This is somebody mad at you, they think it's magic and luck, but again, it's the hard work that you put in. Back to what I was just saying a minute and a half ago. The garden here, Libra, fixed sign energy, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. This is you moving in silence and minding your own damn business. And then surprising them, what? Showing everybody what you've been working on here in silence. And it, let me tell you, with this five of baskets here, people are going to be sick. Green throw up face emoji. Sick about what Libra's got going on here. The ace of nights. The minute they hear about this, the proof. Oh, just because Libra wasn't saying anything there. There was things going on. When people hear about this, the news. Blowing up your phone about these opportunities that are coming in for you with this three of wands and this mother of sticks here. This is attracting a lot of opportunities so not just you looking good not just being promiscuous not just being a third party okay with this mother of six but this is getting things done looking good while doing it people are paying attention to you libra and again there are some people coming around now that it's popular to support you the four but you don't have time for it with this four of cups no messages not received in the blocked messages inbox. Don't have time for it. Not responding to their messages, not picking up their phone calls. Moving on and moving forward. This Ada one speaks to something being stagnant, no longer communication, swift movement, um, traveling. You're making moves. You don't have time for the nonsense. That's exactly what this is. Libras. This five of coins being. Clarified by the Son of Sticks. Again, capitalizing on these opportunities. We see this young boy, young boy, young person with this page of wands. We see this person with six fingers. Sixes being a number of choice and the consequences of our actions. You being impulsive, 
grabbing the bull by its horns with all these snakes around you, rattlesnakes, waiting for you to mess up. But y'all not letting the haters get in your mind here with this Eight of Swords here in the reverse. For those of you where you're dealing with in a relationship with somebody who's playing the mind games, you're feeling happier without this person. And not only that, new doors are opening up for you. New relationships, better jobs, feeling better, doing what it is that you're doing because you're not stressed with this person. The Son of Knives here, the Page of Swords in the reverse. This person only being able to see you from a distance. We see the sun of sticks again. You making moves and not looking back, keeping them in the rear view mirror. This person wanting to reach out and touch you, but just being too far, out of touch. Not able to get to you. Watching your social media, having to ask people what's going on with Libra. Oh, we used to be friends. Now they're, now they're not picking up the phone. What's going on? Mm -hmm. Wishy-washy. Emotionally imbalanced. Now you're the one Libra who's emotionally unavailable, but really it's them that's immature in the way that they do things, the way that they handle themselves. Y'all have other opportunities coming in. Divine blessings with the Ace of Cups here. This is love overflowing, but this could be making it rain here. We see the Daughter of Coins again with the money, again with the stability. For those of you wanting a real relationship, that is coming in, but you have to let this thing go. Got to completely shut the door and leave it behind. We see that here with the free man, the fool, which is the start of a brand new journey. You're going to have to start ignoring somebody who didn't appreciate you until it was popular to do so, Libra. Uh. For new opportunities, greener grasses elsewhere. Didn't I tell you new opportunities? This is blessings coming in with the six of cups. New love. Again, opportunities, 666, six, six, right? The six of swords, the six of baskets, and the six of coins. Come on now. Five, 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 and the railroad bill, big cancer energy. Somebody doubling back, mm. wanting to make you a proposal. Others of you with this railroad bill. Some of y'all aren't necessarily moving on at all. And when I say not moving on, not that you're not receiving these blessings, but some of y'all aren't moving right into a relationship here with this Nine of Pentacles, big Virgo energy. Some of y'all are just staying single and working on whatever the, this new financial opportunity that is coming your way. Some of y'all are getting very focused on your career and focusing on your money. Ooh, the Nine of Baskets, which is living a life of luxury. We had that Nine of Wands too. Come on, nine, 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 six, 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 five, five, five. Somebody drop those down with the meanings in the comment section. And you would be the real, making your dreams come true. Didn't I say that earlier? Libra, stop playing with me. Some of y'all aren't even worried about love right now, but cutting the situation off to, again, capitalize on making your dreams come true. Stacking your paper, buying that house, buying that car, getting that degree, right? The three of baskets, and you can celebrate later. This, eight, this star here is Aquarius energy. This is wish fulfillment, being in divine alignment, making a wish, and you ask, so you shall receive. But again, this is for the movers and the shakers, Lazy people need not apply. This is not for you. This is things coming together and you're not having to fight for it or ask for it. This is being given to you because you put in the work. And when I say given, I mean you most certainly earned it. This is you benefiting finally from all of your hard work. This is you benefiting, okay, for staying on the path less chosen, entrusting the process here with this ace of sticks. Brand new passion opportunities coming, grabbing the bull by the horns. It's giving mystical. I came here with my dick in my hand. Don't make me put my motherfucking foot in your ass. Be cool. This is that, even though he's very problematic. This is that energy, Libra. This is you not getting in your own way. The five of swords, and you can show them much better than you could tell them. This is you being the conversation. This is letting people know what it is. But again, we see that dime in this person's mouth. 
Letting your money speak for you. Libras. The Seven of Pentacles. Scorpio energy here with the ancestors. Shout out to the cross watchers that are on the Scorpio Sagittarius cusp. Sagittarius energy here with the temperance card and the Seven of Pentacles. The death. One door closing so that new doors can open for you. This is opportunity. Looking at your long-term goals. Looking at who's been putting in effort, who's been standing in your corner versus who's not, who you got to leave behind and making it happen. Making it happen for yourself, not being afraid to reinvent yourself, change directions, but tired of being patient. You Now you don't have to because it's being given to you. Libras, happy birthday. Drop your birthdays down below. Let me know where you're watching from. Hit the like button, subscribe, share this video. Reach out to me for personal readings. That information is down in the description box. Find, follow me on Instagram. And family, Libras, I will be checking in with you soon. Keep it real.